What's up guys, this is iTweets here, and today I'm going to be showing you a winter board theme called Kiki. Now this is a really cool theme and it's free and allows you to not only change the icons, but you can change the shape of the icons as well. So you can change it to a circular theme, even a square theme. So let's take a closer look at these, and you can see it has more of a softer palette to this theme. And it has pretty good icon support as well, so if we swipe over here, you can see that it does a pretty good job. And I really like the uh, Instagram icon right here. And I mean, it just looks really good all together. Now, even if your icons aren't supported in terms of being themed, you still get that circular look like these icons right here if you enable that feature in Winterboard. Now, there's also going to be another thing that you'll notice up here in the top left-hand corner. Not that Pac-Man, but the other two indicators right here for the Wi-Fi and data. So a full circle right there is showing you that you have full bars for your Wi-Fi and then over here on the left of the Pac-Man is the data signal so not a very good signal right there but it's actually a pretty cool way to uh, show exactly what's going on with your data without taking up a whole lot of space now you are going to have to add a repo for this theme as well as these uh, themes for the status bar indicators right here so let's just jump into Cydia here I'm going to show you the theme as well as what you have to do in order to get those status icons to work. So right here is the description. It's going to tell you that in order to install this, you are going to have to delete var mobile library caches com.apple UI status bar. So you are going to have to have iFile in order to get to this file. Now to get there, obviously, all you have to do is follow that path and you're going to be able to delete it. Once you delete it, if you've already installed the uh, theme for the status bar icons up here, then you will have to respring your device. Once you respring, you will have these new themed status bar indicators right up there. So just to show you quickly, what you need to do is go into iFile, and we're going to go all the way back to the very beginning, and then we're going to go into var down here at the bottom. We're going to go into mobile, library, and then scroll down here to caches and then you're going this is all in alphabetical order so just look for com.apple.ui status bar looks like I passed it okay so here it is right here so all you would want to do is tap on edit and then tap on that to select it and then you want to hit the trash can right there to delete it now this is actually the replaced one you'll notice I have two of them and that's just because I renamed the UI status bar right here rather than deleting it and then it installed another one then once that's installed just respring your device and you should be good to go and you'll have those indicators right up there now if we jump into Winterboard here I just want to show you some of the features that this theme has you don't necessarily have to have these circle icons you can change that to the diamond icons you can even have uh, square icons or squircle so let's go ahead and try the squircle and see exactly what that does all right so there you go it actually looks pretty good I like the way that this looks it has more of a uh, square look to it rather than the circular ones of course it does have more of a circular look to it than the square ones do but it's basically just a combination between the two it actually looks pretty good so let me know what you guys think about this theme in the comments below. If you enjoyed this video, please hit that like button. If you want to see more of my videos, then go ahead and subscribe. Also, don't forget to like my Facebook page and follow me on Twitter for updates. And if you haven't checked out my gaming channel, go over there and stop by and say hey. All right, guys. Until next time. Peace.